Hello, Simai. Tamara Dianor, joy formidable. Vidi Dianon. I'm Matt. <laughs> and I think we'll be out billboard. So welcome back. This is your second South by. You were saying um, la- right. first time around is more of acoustic, low key affair. Now you're. Well, no, that was just one. Oh, show. just 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 here. Okay. Yeah, yeah, that was just here at the yeah. Belmont. But um, no, we did nine shows. At, wow. And uh, yeah, it wasn't very mellow. Put it like that. <laughs> Still recovering actually from last South by. No, we had a good time in 2011, and uh, yeah, this time round's not disappointing either. Yeah. It's a bit crazy, isn't it? We've had a it's good fun. Time, we yeah. we we embrace the chaos, don't we, Matt? We do enjoy a bit of chaos, yes. And you enjoyed rather a few chocolate martinis yesterday too. So you've got a new album, Wolf's Law, out right now. Um, tell us a little bit about just what, what what was the mood or what was inspiring you going into this record? Uh, well, it was a really great energy. I think we were really hungry to get back into the studio. And, uh, you know, we write a lot on the road. And we've been writing over the course of 12 months of touring the first record. So... But it's a different type of writing, you know, kind of trying to grab time in the back of the tour bus or in hotel rooms. And I think we were just really kind of looking forward to, you know, going somewhere, losing ourselves in, you know, in making the record. So we locked ourselves away in a little cabin in the forest just outside of Portland, Maine. And, um, yeah, very proud of the record that we've made. I mean, you know, it's kind of really captured a moment, moment in our careers in time and we're having a lot of fun playing the songs live. Uh, I think it's quite different from the first record. We we went back and stripped it back to the basics, uh, just writing on, on one instrument like an uh, acoustic guitar or piano for instance. Um, and I think because of that it's a very vocal record, a very uh, lyrically driven. We've always had a really strong lyrical side to the band but I think maybe this exposes it a little bit more. Um, but in terms of subject matter, it covers everything from the personal to wider social issues as well. You know, we certainly enjoy the album format still and the peaks and troughs that come with that. You know, we don't want to write um, just uh, 12 singles. Um, we want a bit more uh, depth. And like Richard said, we're very proud of it. So, Is there anything on your go-to list while you're in Austin in addition to, of course, playing gigs? Um, well, we're Dude, playing love a, Austin, actually, yeah. a city anyway. You know. Well, I think it's just a good co- a kind of a mixture. I mean, obviously, it's just nice to stroll and just come across things. I mean, we haven't had a lot of time, but hoping over the next couple of days we get a little bit more gaps. Um, and then it's, I mean, it's such a beautiful city as well, and the river. I just enjoyed kind of getting away from kind of the urban core yesterday, and I went to find some egrets and turtles, and I waited for an hour to see the bats yesterday, and they never fucking came out. <laughs> How? How inconsiderate is that, they eh? Come out on time, they obviously they? weren't They're hungry. Rude. They, uh, the bats, you just can't tell them, you know. I say, hey bats, you know what, you should come out on time every night. But no, they just don't listen. But they come when you don't want them, like when you're sleeping. Yeah, they're, <laughs> they're really, yeah, they're thoughtful, those bats. A lot of tours coming up. You've got your label mates, Kitten, joining you for a couple mm-hmm. shows. Some, some of the other folks in the Warner family. Tell us a little bit of what the next few months look like for you guys. Busy, busy, like um, touring, you know, for the whole year, but we, we're looking forward to it. We like yeah. being on the road. And um, yeah, on this next uh, American leg, there's, like you say, there's Kitten, there's Guards, there's Fort Lean, uh, Team Io Spirit. Echo, Team Spirit. Yeah, plenty of bands, and it's all bands that we've uh, chosen. I think that's important, you know, there are no, no backhanders, nothing like that. And aside from the endless touring, we've, uh, we're working on. Um, a Welsh language record, that's really? our first yeah, language. Yeah. Um, uh, some film scoring and there's some dance projects uh, um, that we're working on as we speak actually as Interesting. well. So, uh, so the Dead busy. Mouse wasn't a too much of a, a leap as far no, as we're Interesting, yeah. okay. Yeah. We'll, we'll, we'll keep an eye out for that. Well, <laughs> Joy Formidable, thanks guys. Thank Welcome, you. thank you.